push to X, push to talk, push to whatever, but particularly the voice side of it will never go away. So look, when I was 20 years old, I started working for a company called Nextel. Now, most of you probably don't know what Nextel even is, but they had one really cool application that allowed them to be the most profitable cell phone carrier of all time. They had the highest stock price, the best margins, the most loyal customer base, the longest lifetime value. I mean, they were the dominant player. And if it wasn't for the government coming in and taking uh, back the spectrum that they were putting their cell phone communication on, they would probably still be the most dominant cell phone carrier to this very day. Most people don't know your cell phone history, but if you look it up, that is the actual truth. Now, when I was working there, I was telling people, I was telling product managers and innovators, I was saying, voice communication will never go away. I said, this ability to send voice notes back and forth, this walkie-talkie service that has been out back then, it had still been out for 30, 40, 50 years. But I said, this, this style, this medium of communication will never go away. And people said, no, especially as Nextel went away and then Push the Talk tried to move over and I did some work with Boost Mobile and I tried to move over there. I did some work at AT&T and, uh, and, and we, we had enhanced Push the Talk and it was a big part of, of, of uh, mobilizing and, and spreading that all across the country. But I used to tell people, product people, innovators, I used to tell thought leaders, voice communication, this platform of push to X, push to talk, push to whatever, but particularly the voice side of it will never go away. But you see, what was interesting is people didn't see that. They didn't see the vision of it. But I will tell you today that there were little companies that believed in that kind of a vision and they got bought out for like a billion dollars called WhatsApp in Voxer, in Viber, and all these companies who saw the vision of where to take voice and how to utilize it in our day, okay? And what I wanna tell you is I believe very strongly that voice communication on mobile apps, on your website, on anywhere where you communicate, on your social media applications, anywhere that you communicate with your customers, voice will, will make a massive, massive resurgence, especially as technology begins to clutter your life, clutter up everything you do, as more and more stuff and banners and, and ads and, and uh, you know, all these different uh, experts and everybody just is throwing all this stuff at you, the ability to hear someone's voice clearly will always dominate. And innovators will always find out, how do I take my voice as the expert? And how do I put that right in front of somebody. Let me tell you what, the future of where you need to be thinking about putting your voice is two places, on their phone and in their home. And if you think about those two places, how can you get your voice on their phone and in their home? I'm telling you, you're on the path of true innovation. That's a true thought. That's where true thought leaders are taking the innovation of voice right now. And if I were you, I would really, really consider what you can do with your technology, with whatever you do, to take voice and take it to the next level.